Mm -hmm. The moose tracks on the sidewalk. So today we are checking in to Wilderness Lodge. Uh, room's not ready yet, so we're gonna do a little walking tour around the resort. Do a little bit of filming. And walk down to Fort Wilderness. Do some filming there. See, that's how our old rooftop box open. Oh. Good morning. Good, and you? Excellent. Inside the main lobby. Good morning. Right in? Yes. All the guest areas. The Mickey Totem. <laughs> and then you can mail your letter from Disney so that people get the stamp from here. I like the shirt. That would be good Grayson. Yeah. Yeah, the Mickey Totem Pole shirt. This is the store. Still have some of the Christmas stuff out too. <coughs> Snap bracelet magic bands, along with the traditional ones. And the keychain, so you can put your magic band center in there. If you don't want to wear it or don't like the feel of them. Instead of this, no, how do you one thing? Is that one? No. Disney wines. Picture frames. So they've got a, not a full selection, but a decent selection of grocery type items as well and snacks. They've got your mac and cheese in a bowl, some jam, donuts. Not sure I'd want a box of donuts like that, but. <coughs> I 
You got your yogurts and Lunchables and stuff. Pop and water. And beer. Not a beer drinker, but they got the beer. Pandora charms. Partner's one right there. Mm -hmm. I don't see the mom one. No, we'll have yeah. to find that probably at Downtown Disney. At that Pandora. Yeah. <laughs> My mom would have got that. Yeah. Yep. And then there's the... She likes ones that you find in the beach, though. I know. That was the shirt I would like. Oh, wow. It's very soft. <laughs> yeah. Possibly. I like this one too. No strings attached. Oh, there we go. Hello Sunshine. I'd wear that one. Okay. That one I would wear. I like the color and I like orange bird, so. Okay. Looking at the kids. Oh, there's... Yeah. It's actually small. So I feel fully growing to it. Yeah. Wow, that hurt. I would say that's Stella. Yeah. Yeah. And there's the Wilderness Lodge travel mug thing. I'm a glamour that camera. Yeah. You would think that would be sold more over at uh, Fort Wilderness than Wilderness Lodge, but... See, I like the old... The old style. From way back in the days. When I first came down here. Oh, there's... See, there's the luggage. The mug like the sketch on the bag. If they did sell it here. Yeah. I like the artwork too. Mm -hmm. What? Can I make it? Oh, yeah, they'll do that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, they've got some of the doings here. Oh, yeah. 35 to 1. Yeah. The water was raining last time we were here, but not the late stuff. That's fine. That fireplace over there. Yeah. It's so pretty. Yes. And the train. <laughs> yep. So this, this little geyser, it actually bubbles up and that runs all the way out and feeds the pool. So this water here runs out to feed the main pool at Wilderness Lodge. Yeah. So you can see. How it runs down. I'll try and see if we can see a decent shot of it outside. Yeah, this runs all the way down and feeds the main pool. We can actually walk down and across and see more of it. Yeah. 
<laughs> Locking us out. So this is the courtyard by where the main pool is. The theming at the Disney resorts, I've stayed a lot of different places, but the theming here at all the resorts at Disney just seems to be that next step above what your standard place is. Um, took the kids to Great Wolf Lodge in Niagara a bunch, and they do a, a good job of it, but it's just not quite the same. I mean, it's decent, and it, it reminds me of Wilderness Lodge, but it's not quite the same. So yes, here you go. Here's the water running down. Goes to the main pool. Yeah, so you can see, like, the pool, it continues to run off the pool and out and back down. And you get little friendly squirrels here. <laughs> You've got... Two hot tubs, not just one, but two. One's handicap accessible. And then you've got the kids splash area over here. So this is the main pool at uh, Wilderness Lodge. There's also a DVC section where there's a pool. I will, I'll record that after. We're just doing the main area right now. Down by the geyser and over to where the boat dock is. Yeah, so this is all water coming from the pool. And this is the little boardwalk area around the outside that leads down to the dock. So yes, here's, here's the kids' splash area. If you have any questions about any of the areas, um, this, you know, the kids' play areas, the pools, anything like that, Drop a comment below, um, feel free to ask. We will answer as many questions as we possibly can. Uh, I mean, by no means are we experts on the resorts. I, I know a fair bit, but there's always stuff to be learned. Um, so if you have any questions, absolutely ask. We're happy to answer. And if we don't know the answer, we will find it for you. So yeah, so you come down here and you get your boat transportation over to Magic Kingdom. Um, and then you can go to the parks or jump on the monorail and ride the monorail around the, uh, the loop for the resorts, the monorail resorts. There's the water coming down from the lodge. Copper Creek Falls. And down this way you've got your boat transportation. Uh, 
then it finishes off with this last little run down into the pool. Now I do find that the water at the pool here in Wilderness Lodge tends to be a little chillier than the other pools. And I think that's probably because of the way they run the water down out of the main lodge into the pool. So it has a lot more time to cool off because the pools are all heated. But uh, I, I think that's part of the reason that that happens. So right up here is the DVC. So we're in the DVC section of Copper Creek. And right up here is the DVC pool. <coughs> so it's got a mining town type of theme to it. Morning. So yeah, we'll get some better images and recordings of it later. But this is this is the uh, DVC Boulder Ridge portion of the DVC pool. <laughs> 